like some people are like, oh, are you a model or oh, are you an actress? Or I'll be like, no, actually, I'm an actress or or I, I used to model. I thought you were moving to Houston. Last minute change in plans. Yeah, her parents moved. Well, didn't. So you're staying here? Wow. That's just, that's great, <laughs> you know, for you guys. It's really real. We deal with really, really real issues. Like, the, the writing's awesome. The characters are all great. Like, there's a lot of characters actually in the show. It's a huge ensemble cast. It's sort of like the new Degrassi in a way. So, it's really fun. It's a really good show. Laurel's a classic Toronto princess. She'll never survive without mommy and daddy. She's definitely like the catty one out of the group. She's like one of the, like the popular girl at school. She's always sort of gossiping and she's really feisty. She's really truthful. She speaks her mind. She's always like knows what's going on. She's always talking about everything to everyone. So, it's a fun character. really supported me and they trusted me a lot I mean they would come with me like if I was doing a shoot but they both worked so if I was doing a shoot like a commercial all week they would come with me like every other day and like now there are rules that say that parents someone has to like be like with you but when I was doing it there, those rules weren't in apply yet I think at that age, acting was just so overwhelming for me. I didn't know if I wanted to do it all my life, really. It was just a lot of fun. And I got braces, and like I just like did like some normal things, played soccer, got hurt, because I was always really, really athletic. Like I was always a tomboy when I was a kid. And like when you're acting and modeling, you can't have scratches and bruises. So I think I just needed some time to just go off and, and hurt myself a bit. never like, oh, I want my own website. Like, I was never like that, but um, I just had fans who kept on emailing me or my agent or just like putting up like making kind of sort of like mini websites going like, is there a fan club or da da And I was like, wow, I have fans. People started doing it for me. I had fans making up little websites, so I was like, I better make an official one. <laughs> because like there was like stuff on there that's not true. She's going out with this person. No, I'm not. <laughs> so I was like, hey, it's time to make an official one. Apparently she threw some fit at the airport and refused to get on the plane. So her parents just left. Now she's sleeping in Mark's basement. Poor Tracy. Just when he was almost in your clutches. I couldn't care less. Once you get into this business, you just realize it's really not, it's, it's pretty corrupt and it's pretty crazy, but it's not all that bad if you don't get your head into it.